Hello, welcome to Them Morons. We're playing Gala Darkness again. And I'm lost. And Devin's here. Somehow. Yeah, so... Uh, this is sort of another thing we were talking about, was like, sometimes some of us would just randomly be here. Me? Because I actually... Because <laughs> I work. <laughs> Which one did you battle? I'm blue. The, blue. the water... Oh, you're going to get steel. Teon. I love the music. Horsey. I need more of those. I also <laughs> need more goldings. Yeah. And magic cards. You need a ton more magic cards. Oh, let's yeah. not even talk about magic cards. You got six games. I've got like 14, I think. Did you match your Yeah. Match one. I would. Which one do you think has more special things? I think Golding has Golding or Horsey. It's a good They're both, say horse. They're both Gen 1, so. What? Well, well I'll. They're both basically. Yeah. It's not gonna matter, honestly. Ooh, the horsey head. I think horsey head. Works. They're both terrible. Yeah. Let's not mince words. And, and they're they're shadows, they're both tomorrow. terrible. Spiel for a base evolution is actually pretty decent. Yeah. And it goes to uh, Wall Celio. 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 Wall Rain. Wall Wall Rain. I love that. It's not that great. Dude, hey, he it's was great. For his gen, he was great. First generation, yes, he was amazing. But nowadays he's like, man. Oh, so. oh great. But it's purification. Uh, well, the good thing about this is that it, uh, I get to call it. Yeah. So let's actually fight the gold bean and have to call this. I hate using it. <laughs> oh, bro, I said it's almost purified. It's, it's a ball form, I feel as well. Medium. Eh. Yeah, it's still a lot better than the space. I can't look at Ladybug without thinking of, uh, of Pokemon X and Y. Because did you guys ever do the, uh, the trainer videos? Or no, it wasn't X and Y. It was a Black and White 2, I think. You never played Black and White 2. Really? So you could do, like, movies in that game? Uh, you hear what I'm talking about? You, could, you, you could, have to do it at first. Yeah. Because it's a required thing mm -hmm. to do. You could, uh, you could film movies and stuff. And there was one where Pokemon took over and Elidium was like the leader. And literally the battle was between the trainers. So it was like you against another trainer. <laughs> it's really, really fun to record. There was one against a, um, a giant uh, mecha type of Yeah, there's that one. But the first one you do is like your Riley man. Yeah. I did, I did not care for Generation 5, but that was really fun. I liked, a, I liked a, like a lot. They were really good. Generation 5 was alright. Definitely not my favorite. Not by a long shot. Mm -hmm. I mean, for Pokemon... Oh, come on, Ezra. How do you miss attack? Yeah. If, if I were to rank, like, the generations, I'd say... I'd put 4 on top. I would say 3, 6, 2, 4, 1, 5. I would put, uh, to me, I would put two, two, three, four, one, six, five. Oh god, this is, this is tough. What? I'm trying to organize them all. No four is on top. I love two. Second. See, I didn't have much time in Generation 2. I didn't either, but what I did, I would have. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I that's silver. That's, a lot that's of really good. That's honestly the, basically the only game throughout all the whole Pokemon series that you get to travel into two. Mm -hmm. I love it. I mean, you kind of get that in um, Fire and the Dream. Mm -hmm. Not really. Not kind of. Much. I mean, like, literally in, like, Soul Silver Heart Gold, well, it was literally, like, here. You had 16 bags. Yeah. And that's also like that in the original Gold and Silver. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, Iwata. And way to make everyone cry. Yeah, I still cry about it, man. Yeah. I remember when it happened, like, I was I was so distraught. Hey, look, it's ready. Yeah. I'm switching out with it. Oh, Zito. Zito. Come on, Zito. Just come on, Zito. <laughs> that one missed. Yeah, it missed. That was bad. You should be ashamed. I am ashamed. <laughs> it still doesn't take 
the cake for the worst joke told on this whole thing. <laughs> By me. Yeah. <laughs> what was it? Uh, it was in Super Mario World. There was an enemy by the name of Blurp. I was like, blurp. and I was like, is a blurp when you're saying a word with an L in it, and you, and you burp, and you just go blurp? One of the worst jokes that I've ever heard. I can make them worse. <laughs> Get out of the Catch it. Catch it. Why? Oh, jeez. Alright, in Spanish. <laughs> Shoot it in the face. Speaking of... Did you, did you take Spanish or Japanese, Devin? Uh, Spanish. Okay. They didn't offer Japanese. I was they, going to take Japanese. They took that Japanese? Yeah. Oh. Mr. Bevins went from being a teacher to this. Uh, really? I think. What? Yeah, because he, he subbed in for um, Sturgill at least once. I mean, granted, I mean, the man is like in his mm -hmm. 80s. Yeah. <laughs> so was it just Spanish? It was just Spanish. Really? I, I was really sad because I was looking forward to taking Japanese. Sweet. Sorry, I had to say it. I mean, you would have took it if you had the chance. Well, I had the chance, but I took Spanish. Why? Wow. Um, yeah, because of that reason. Yeah. Granted, like, don't don't get me wrong, the teacher that I had, I love her to death. Like, Yum. yes, loved her. She, that was a lot of fun. God, I remember there was one day after there, we had, when she just gave us that handout. She actually had an extra one, I was just like, you know, we have to have all these answers to give it to Will. <laughs> like, I'm, in every blank spot possible, I wrote these. But she found it before I could, like, you know, give it to Will. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna be like, here, Will, here's all the answers. Because Lord knows he would appreciate that. And then she found it, was like, why are you doing this? And I'm like, so it's gonna be my friend. <laughs> she, she threw it away, and I was like, dang it. See? Dang it, woman. Do they still have the glitch in this game? Or did they fix it? I, I don't know. He which, tried to do I it. I tried it and it didn't work, but I, I mean, did it correctly. It's, it's the right, actual here. disc. What do you do now? Or you go to open? item. Okay. Switch your Pokeball over here from your ball. How do I switch? X. There you go. Now try it. No, so, no, 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 no. It can't do it. I'm just doing another right back. So. If that's what I'm looking for. So weird. No, I said so what? What did you say? Huh? Oh, I don't know. Oh my god. Three. Alright, if you still have 21 Pokeballs, then it worked. Yeah, I have 22. If not, I I then this is the updated there. version. No, it was in Go Coliseum that it worked. I know for a second. Oh, okay. I used it all the time. I swore I saw Jay Wittens do this when he played it. Let's find out. Yeah, so you're getting a call. Yeah, yeah, it's not a call your place. Place. So oh, check your thing. That's yet. not it. <laughs> okay, we got four grand now. Yeah. Oh, buddy. Rolling in items. items. No, nope. nope, they fixed it. I swear it's in. I swear that he's done it in this game. Oh, yeah, there might be a different one. You have guys have a hound door. Yeah. You know that thing's a special attacker? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I did not know that for the longest time. A lot of fire types are actually special attackers. And then you get Flareon. Blaziken is... Well, but the difference is, is like, Blaziken, like... Firefighting. Well, he also has Blaze Kicks, and so he makes up for it. Mm -hmm. But in this game... That's why I said most. But in this game, Blaze Kick's a physical special attack. Really? That's stupid. This is before the yeah, this special is, split. I told you that. That's why I thought it was just special. The I thought it was just the dark split. No. What? What? <laughs> I thought it was just dark types. I thought that's what you said. No, no. I said that. I All was dark types are special attacks. Yes. Yeah. All fire types are special attacks. No, electric types normal are special is, attacks. Normal is physical. Ice types are special attacks. Which is why you would always see Alkazan running Fire Punch, Ice Punch, Thunder Punch back in Gen 3 because, holy god, that is broken. It is. Yeah. So much type coverage was so much damage. And it's just. Wait, which one was this one? Oh, the battle oh. That's that's oh. great. Play that's because that's Play a rock and a psychic type. Ground. Yeah, so I think is it ground? It's ground. I gotta look this up. Here. It's ground. Because I always got that confused. Mm -hmm. oh. Dang it! He's either rock or ground. Or ground. It's ground. Because I can ground. Yeah, he. Because he's weak to uh, water. I mean, rock would be weak to water, too. I know, that's why I said he's either rock or ground. Yeah. The, I remember one of the first times I encountered a it was actually inside the... Uh, Don't put a boo on your nose. It was inside the place where you catch... Uh, your poison. Really? So, okay. So, funny story. 
Um, so if you ever played Gen 3, you probably know about the, um, what do they call them? The talent show things that you can do in your Pokemon? Yeah, it's contest Pokemon. Contest, contest. yeah. Um, so I had, I think I either had a Claydol or a Baltoy that I entered, and it was self-destruct. And like it's it's thing was like all the way up top. I'm like, oh man, I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna like win this. Used it, couldn't compete in the rest of the contest. It wouldn't let me. Are you serious? Yeah. So it's like after like that has to be your finisher if, if you're gonna use it. That's actually really interesting. Oh, I don't want to use it. Back. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah, you go because that would kill it. Well, that thing's very defensive. That's the thing. Uh, yeah, but the bot is uh, special. But he's like, more, that's what I'm he's saying. More, he's more physically defensive. He's got not. He's got pretty good special defense though, because like he's a tank. Well, not in this place. He's still got better special defense. Most. No, don't you though. See which one he has a higher. Rate. I don't. It's either. It's very close. They're very close. Let me look at both of you. Yeah. I'm just gonna look at the best stats. And... That's how you tell. Uh, yeah. Okay. This is this is battle toys. Um. Uh, I mean, they're, they're very similar. He has just a slightly bit more special defense. Which, granted, this this may not be Gen 3 based. Yeah. They don't hardly change anything. Well, like, they change. Actually, you'd be surprised. They change the levels they learn moves at. Well, I'm saying, like, I was just referring to, like, stat, stat wise. Gen they don't 6, change that much. Gen 6 changed a Gen lot. Gen 6 changed a lot, but this isn't Gen 6. Like, from Gen I know, but that's what I'm saying. This is running off of Gen 6. Because this is the most recent. But even, I don't think they're, they're not going to change that much of it, though. Mm. Still, though. Like, the only yeah. thing I can think of that they really changed was Alkazam giving him plus 10 special defense speed. Which is why he's the only Mega Evolution to only get plus 90 to his base stat. Still, though. Because they just was like, okay, we actually we had this in there. Still, after, still like, though, oh. this is going off of Generation 6, so they You can look it up to Generation 6. I yeah. can, yeah. It's, it's, it's not on Bulbapedia. It's on Bulbapedia. Where? I don't see it. I don't know. I it probably only see. has black and white right now, but he has to search Gen 3. And it'll show the Well, there's like coaching. tutoring stuff, but yeah, base stats, there's like nothing to play. I'll just search that up. Okay, so his his didn't change. Hound dooms. I mean, I'm just I'm just saying like that. I'd rather go off of what this generation is than what the new generation is, just in case there's a change. Yeah. The Gen Six changed so much to the formula. Because there were so many Pokemon that got buffs. Because uh, Mewtwo got a really good buff. Well, he got two Megas also. Yeah. Him and Charizard basically is only one of the two mega points. I think so, yes. Yeah. Hey, you caught it. Yeah. Yeah, they're the only ones that stretch across two games. Yeah, but we get to see Gen well. 7's megas. Well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I want Cat Turn to get a mega. Doesn't I'll, he have a mega? No. no. I he got a mega. Nope. That's camera up I'm thinking of then. Yep. Yep. Yeah. And Sharpedo. Oh, and Sharpedo. I like Sharpedo. Mm -hmm. I do not like his mega. I do wish they gave him a body. I just, I hate He's the a way shark. <laughs> I'll tell you, um, I'll tell you someone's Mega that I have a love-hate relationship with is Tyranitar's. Because I'm Mega. I forget yeah. that. <laughs> I, I love his, but he looks like a freaking Christmas tree. <laughs> it's an alright Mega. The only thing I used Ty Tyranitar when I, when I actually competitive battle for was to get rocks up and have sand strength, uh, my sand storm, my sand storm, my, my, my ex it's the electro. I'm sure it's not the I'm almost positive. I believe it's the Marie. Does he have a Marie? Okay, he does have a Marie. I love Ampharos. That's my favorite. Oh, Ampharos is awesome. Ampharos is great. His Mega makes no sense because it becomes a Dragon type. Okay, well, he gets Dragon Pulse normally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that just gives him more weaknesses. It does. You know, we talked about this before that you were leaving. Altaria's type. It gives it, it gives it only two weaknesses. It's Omega. What's its Omega? It's Fairy dragon and Dragon. Fairy. It literally, so, yeah, it literally becomes a Dragon Fairy type. And it's so normal. its weakness is Fairy Steel. Practice it with this fire. No poison. Poison is yeah. also super effective. No, Dragon. What? Yeah, it is. It is. Yep. Hmm. 
It had like five weaknesses, actually. <laughs> you only said two. Did yeah. I? Yeah. Oh, well, you okay. said very stupid. I thought I said more than that, so this actually this is not paralyzed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, these guys, these guys are dead. If we get confusion at level 16, it takes. Yeah. I mean, it's running off of that one that you found. Marie! Wasn't Marie a shadow Pokemon in Coliseum, too? Pretty sure. Uh, yeah, it is. I haven't been there so long. It is. It's been several years. The first shadow Pokemon you Actually, had. it's not a Marie Fugit, it's a Flaffy. Flaffy? I'm pretty sure it's a Flaffy. That's probably why I don't remember it. Flaffy! Flaffy! I mean, they're all cheese. Well, well, except for Ampharos. I have no idea what Ampharos is. That's a lot. Huh? Sheep, <laughs> Sheep What? Shepherd. Yeah. You mean Shepherd? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I know Shadow Blitz. I like this Marie. I like Shadow Blitz a lot better than this. What's Shadow Blitz? It hits both of them. Yeah. Leave Ooh. him alone! Ooh. Leave him alone! I swear to God. <laughs> I'm surprised you're just hitting me right now. Because Zach's too focused right now. Hound door killed itself. That's beautiful. Let's go see that. May as well. Yeah, man. I mean, I have no reason to use Lady before. Not much experience for it. That's about it. Uh, I mean, it's Shadow right now. I mean, it'll get the experience it once will, you will, but we're not going to use it. <laughs> it's just going to sit there for the honest. Both these will give you. you know what, I'll just buy it, I don't care. Bullet seed, actually. So, okay. Wasn't there some way to also get your plant food in the plus or mining? Uh, I think. Maybe? But I don't remember. I don't have, like, I never played Coliseum or Gala Darkness that much. I think I played Coliseum more than Gala Darkness, but I remember more from Gala Darkness. Mm -hmm. I played a lot. I had to take the final boss. I don't think I ever owned that card. Yeah, I don't. I don't think yeah, I ever. Yeah, the final boss has a Tyranitarus Hellman. Ooh, Metagross. Metagross. It's like well, Metagross was a Shadow. Ball. No, it was a. Metagross. Was Metagross? It was Metagross cause then, I well, actually, it. yeah, the Metagross. Then after that, you fight someone else, and he well, has the Tyranitar. I didn't and get Tyranitar that. Tyranitar's the Shadow Pokemon at the end. But that guy had the. I didn't make it that far. <laughs> so, um, apparently Sega didn't like the fact that Nintendo was releasing the NES. So now they've released a, um, a portable, no, a portable Genesis. And it, has, uh -huh. and it has more games on it than the NES. What does the Mini NES have on it? Uh, it's got, like, all the Super Mario Brothers games. So it's, it's got Super Mario, Super Mario Brothers 2, Super Mario Brothers 3. It's got Castlevania, Bubble Bobble. That I was stoked about. Uh, Bubble Bobble. Um, yeah. That's Star Tropics, which I was happy to see. <laughs> um, let me hang up. Are you we looking at Mini Genesis? Oh, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up... Um, here we go, Sega Genesis Classic Game Console. Is that it? No. That's it. Mini Genesis Game Well, these are long episodes anyway. Well, Rob will Nintendo with a Nice. Yeah, Sega's matching here. Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, so, what's coming with that one? Oh, uh, I'm coming with a. With 40 full side games and another 40 bonus arcade slash puzzle games for a total of 80 built in. Oh wow. You'll this be is... able to play all your Genesis hubs with its working cartridge slot. Dang. That's the first time Sega's ever beaten Nintendo on something. And I hate saying Along that. with any compatible titles you download off the internet via an SD card slot. Yeah. Nint S Sega just won Sega the rivalry won. that they ended forever ago. Yeah. The Dreamcast. The Dreamcast which, was a great system. Which now, I need one. Which now Nintendo's gonna... Nintendo's gonna see that, and maybe they'll find they do virtual console we or uh, virtual console GameCube on Wii U. Hopefully, but this is what's on the NES. Uh, balloon and fight. And it comes with two wireless controllers. Oh wow! Like but, instead uh, of having to buy a second wireless one. 
So you get Balloon Fight, Bubble Bobble, Castlevania, Castlevania 2, mm -hmm. uh, Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong Jr., Double Dragon 2, Dr. Mario Excite Bike, Final Fantasy, Galaga, Ghosts and Goblins, Gradius, Ice Climber, Kid Icarus, Kirby's Adventure, Mario Bros., Mega Man 2, Metroid, Ninja Gaiden, Pac-Man, Punch-Out, Star Tropic, Super C, Super Mario Bros., Super Mario Bros. 2, Super Mario Bros. 3, Tecmo Bowl, which I could not be happy with. Uh, the Legend of Zelda and Zelda 2. So it's a it's a good mix. I mean, it's all their like hits. Sure, you it's can all some of their biggest. Either Return or Metal Claw. What do you? Oh, I'm Attack Metal. Yeah. Uh, no. Use Metal Claw. Yeah. Grounder is the special one, so you'll want to use just whatever you got against it. My yeah. coughing. Also, <laughs> so the only like you get a gulpin from this guy. Oh nice. Gulpins are around. Swallow up. I like it better than Grimer. Hey, now, I like Grimer a lot. It's literally just a pile of sludge. Yeah. I mean, at least, hey. well... Hey, let's muck backwards. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the mini so Genesis comes with a oh, it does? ABK as okay. opposed to, um... Let's... Yeah, let's get rid of it. Yeah, I was gonna get. I was gonna say tell it for chance. I tell it because it's, it's a special work. attacker. Or it's a special attacker. Oh my yeah. god! I'm kill me now. Okay. Yeah. And it's I'm just fine sixty-five with the dollars. Have, you, what for is? The mini -Nases. It's just sixty for the mini -Nases. You're paying five dollars for <laughs> five dollars extra for a bunch of other stuff for like forty more games. Yeah. One with a handheld version that won't play hard cartridges. Meaning you have the option of either. Having a legit physical Genesis with you, or a portable version. Mm -hmm. I like the physical Genesis. I will say, um... I know what I'm getting for Christmas. Okay, I was gonna say, I thought that was the box art when No! Are you sure? I'm certain. Where would I be getting herpes from? <laughs> I don't know. This, this picture, oh my god. I wish they'd make a Pokemon Go app, but so you don't have to go outside. Like, if you could catch Pokemon by moving the avatar and the game around, someone put literally every Pokemon game on the Well, it only has up to Gen 3. It's literally every Pokemon Why? game except for Pokemon. They Pokemon. put Pokemon Pinball on there. You actually do catch Pokemon. Can you catch Pokemon? I never, yeah. I never played Pokemon Pinball. I, I played, played it. Too. I played Dude, it was game fun. Game one. It was fun. I played the game ones. Those were good. I played the uh, the one that actually was, came out for uh, third gen. See, gen, gen three will always be my favorite because that's where I started, mm -hmm. technically. Because I, I I had crystal version, but I only had it a week, and then I had it a week. All right. So back in you know back in the day when you wanted to carry around multiple games with you, you didn't really have cases, so if you you know you had to bring extra things to the pocket. Oh my god. Well, let's just say that Crystal Version got left in my pocket and my pants got washed. <laughs> completely, <laughs> completely fried everything, so... But then, my Gen 3 story gets even funnier because I got Ruby Version, that was the first version. Lost it, got Sapphire, put over 200 and some hours into it, got another copy of Ruby, and then found my old Ruby. So I had two copies of Ruby. I had both copies, and I lost my Sapphire on the plane. Oh. In Hawaii. Oh. So, yeah. Well, the funny thing was is that I remember having that Ruby game when we went somewhere, when we went to some hotel, and then I couldn't find it after we got back, so I thought we left it in the hotel. No, it was in my, it was in my dad's room. I don't know. It just somehow wound up in dad's room. Hmm. There you go. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna play level one pinball now. <laughs> What'd you download an emulator? Yeah. <laughs> is Spinda in this game? I think it is. Yeah. Yes, because it is Gen 3. Spinda is the weirdest Pokemon to me. Yeah, it is. You know it has like over like a billion different like variations of itself? Because uh, its eyes can be spinning in different ways and the dots on it are always different. Yeah. I actually, let me look that up. Right, I'm actually going to try to catch this ball from now. I want to be on, on point. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna... Yeah. Catch this ball from now. Oh wait, how about, how about that? Another useless trivia episode. Because I'm just on VG Facts. Not really. Um... Where was it? <coughs> Where is it? Uh, okay, here we go. So this is for the new South Park game that's coming out. First one, the game was originally to be called The Butthole of Time, 
However, after being told the retailers wouldn't allow the term butthole to be sold on shelves, the series creators, Trey Parker and Matt Stone, it's instead decided on the fractured butthole. Mm -hmm. And then the other one, to improve on from the previous game, the Stick of Truth series creator, Trey Parker, watched YouTube Let's Player PewDiePie's run of Stick of Truth, see what worked and what didn't. Didn't we already fight him? Yeah, but you can just keep fighting him. Oh. So, Whoops. <laughs> so on that note, we're just going to end the episode, get out of this fight, and then we'll pick up with... Do we have any... We don't have any left to fight, do we? I fought all of them. Alright, so we're just watching. Why can't you fight them again? Uh, experience. Uh, Alright, bye guys! Bye! I'll tell you.